What is camshaft? A camshaft is only a shaft on which cams are installed. The camshaft is mounted on bearing in the lower part of the cylinder block, most inline engines. In some engines, it is placed on the cylinder head. A cam is a device that changes the rotary motion of the camshaft into linear motion of the follower or filter. The cams have a high spot or lobe. The follower riding on the cams will move away from or towards the camshaft as the cam rotates. A camshaft is responsible for opening the valves. A camshaft has several cams along with the length, two cams for each cylinder, one to move the inlet valve and the other to operate the exhaust valve. Furthermore, the camshaft has an eccentric to run the fuel pump and gear to operate the ignition distributor and oil pump. Parts of Camshaft 1. Cam Bearing Journals the cam is a rotating component that provides reciprocating or oscillating motion to the follower by direct contact. This is typically used to change the movement from the rotary to linear. 2. Bearing Shell The bearing shell is part that is mounted on the cam bearing journals. It helps to protect the camshaft from breaking the engine block in case of engine failure. Bearing shells keep the camshaft in a smooth rotation. 3. Lobes During the rotation of the camshaft, the lobes work with the motion of the piston. The purpose of lobes is to open and close the valves for intake and exhaust gases. Its speed usually depends on the engine speed. 4. Thrust plate when using a roller cam you will need to provide some means to support the cam at the rear of the engine. The thrust plate is attached between the cam and timing gear and mounted on the front cover for proper end play. 5. Chain Sprocket A chain sprocket is attached to the camshaft end of the engine to retain the timing belt. This sprocket is attached to a chain. These sprockets are capable of turning at the same speed even if they do not touch. 6. Woodruff Key The Woodruff Key is also the main part of the camshaft of the engine that is used to retain the cams at the right time. How does camshaft work? The camshaft is operated by the crankshaft either by a pair of meshing gears, timing gears, or a pair of timing sprockets connected by chains. The camshaft gear or sprocket has as many teeth as the gear or sprocket on the crankshaft. This gives a 1 is to 2 gear ratio. The camshaft rotates at half the speed of the crankshaft. Therefore every two revolutions of the crankshaft create one revolution of the camshaft and one opening and closing of each valve in the four-cylinder engine. The gear and sprocket maintain a definite time relationship between the camshaft and crankshaft to ensure opening the valves exactly at the correct time in relation to piston position. Timing marks on the gears and sprockets are used to set the shaft in correct times with each other when the units are assembled. The figure shows that the smaller circle on the crankshaft timing gear must fall between the two smaller circles on the crankshaft timing gear to ensure correct valve timing. The sprocket marks are in a straight line with the centers of both shafts to ensure correct valve timing. Material used for camshaft an engine camshaft is made of solid metal to achieve greater rigidity. Camshafts are usually made of cast iron as it gives more strength and is also used for mass production. A chilled iron camshaft can give you good wear resistance and hence the chilling process hardens the material. A variety of materials are mixed with iron to form more suitable properties for the purpose of its application. Some manufacturers also use billet metal when high quality and low production is required. However, it requires more time and cost than other methods. It is manufactured by forging, casting, or machining on a lathe and milling machine. Applications of Camshaft The camshaft is the rotating part of the engine cylinder. They are mainly employed to convert rotary motion into reciprocating motion. In the IC engine, the camshaft is employed to operate the intake and exhaust gas from the poppet valve, 
which is mechanically controlled by the ignition system and electric motor. Sometimes the camshaft also operates as rocker arms to move the exhaust valve from the back of the cam that is 180 degrees with the inlet valve.